I've been working on this today. I got on the rotisserie yesterday and I did quite a bit of blasting on it today. Down in the channels, I actually started already cutting some of the resistance welds out. The only way I know how to get in here is with a cutoff wheel, so it looks hacked, but I don't really know how else to do it. But I would like to get that done. Actually, it is pretty much done now the way. And since it's on the rotisserie, now's the time to do it because you can't get in it from the top side. Other than that, I don't want to spin it around just for the sake that I don't want any of the dust falling out just yet since I cleaned up. That sunroof, all I did was put on the rotisserie and then unbolted it, and then I just was able to pick it up and take it out that way besides having to get some help or trying to find out how to do it from the top side down. But yeah, this is what I have going on. I think the quarter panels, even though I did sandblast some areas, I might just cut them off. I'm going to have to blast it a few times. I actually got the lead out after I had done some blasting. But yeah, you can see all them resistance welds. I mean, this is a good, these are usually not rotted out, but pretty much the whole bottom side of the car is just trashed. Honestly, even the floor pans aren't really all that great either. The areas that I have to save, they're really not all that great. You can see a couple uh, holes right down there. But yeah, pretty much the whole bottom section and the quarter panels are pretty much getting tossed. Up there, that's where I typically section the roof line from the ins uh, from the inside, anyways. But this will get me started. I'll go ahead and I might be able to start drilling some of the resistance welds out tomorrow, but we'll see. Um, I'm gonna have to get some more of that media too. I ran out. I should have gotten a couple bags, but I didn't. Rotisserie, it's set up pretty well. It's not perfectly balanced, but it's good enough. Okay, bye.